Hello everybody out there. I saw a really interesting fish tank the other day over at Tongs Tropical Fish in Fountain Valley, California. That's in Orange County. Let me get that credit out of the way. It's, it's located over there at their store. It's not my tank, but they were kind enough to let me film it. And this was an interesting tank for many reasons. Let me first of all talk about the electric blue jack Dempsey's over here on the right side. And these fish are just, in my opinion, as good as it gets for freshwater fish. They really pop. They're really only two colors, but the blacks and the blues and the amazing detail on this species is just something that I've always been attracted to. And, and you know, it's, it's, it's a beautiful fish, but yet it's still easy on the eyes, unlike some African cichlids and, and peacock cichlids, which almost have too much color, too much pop at times. This is just simple blues and blacks and just, just a gorgeous fish. The only, the only problem is that these guys get pretty big, up to a foot long, and then you get into the dilemma of you know, where to house them, how big of a tank you need, and then what you can house them with. It, it can get kind of complicated, but I think at some point I may get a tank that I, that I devote just to one or two of those because they're just such incredible fish. So let me pull back out here to the wide angle shot here and you can see they've done a really good job with the aquascaping in this tank. They got a number of different schooling type of fish here. You see some tiger barbs and then a fish that I'm a really big fan of are those denison barbs, also known as roseline sharks. You've seen those in my 65 gallon tank. And these particular ones they have right here, I'm not sure if, if it really the video does it justice. These guys are really rather large and meaty. They're about five inches long. And I gotta figure it takes probably three, four, maybe even five years to get them that large. Cause I've had them for a couple of years in my tank and none of them are even close to that size. There's one maybe kind of close, but those are definitely a few years old. So I thought this was a beautiful tank also because it's a unique shape, you know, because of the length and the width and then obviously really cool aquascaping so i just thought it was a really unique tank not something you see every day and this is a display purposes only tank nothing in here is for sale it's just kind of a show tank within the store so i wanted to share it with everybody here on youtube please let me know what you think of the tank in the comments and also like and subscribe please thank you for watching